Avoid Himalayan. Here are the four reasons. I have been owning this tiger for the past couple of years now and whatever shortcomings and problems I have observed on this bike are applicable for Himalayan 450 or 452 as well. Why? Because Himalayan has never been as close to tiger as it is now. This was qualifying statement. So here are the four reasons to avoid Himalayan. Okay, so the first reason is if you have no plan to take it off-road, don't buy a Himalayan. The reason is, look at this, front 21 inch wheel, it is meant to take you off-road and Himalayan gets a 21 inch spoke wheel. Up front it gets a 21 inch wheel, long travel suspension. It means it indicates that it is meant to take you off-road. And if you are not going off-road, I think you should avoid it. The reason is very simple. So, the 21 inch wheel is amazing off the road, but on the road, it can scare you at times. When you are in the twisties and the corners, this 21 inch wheel will not give you the confidence that you are looking for. And trust me, I have been riding this bike for more than four years now. And I can tell you for sure that this 21 inch wheel is amazing off the road, but on road, it is not good. If you have no plan to take Himalayan off road, don't buy it. Second and biggest reason is if, if you are predominantly going to ride in the city, avoid Himalayan. Reasons are very simple. There is no problem riding this bike, right? So I'm sure there are many people who can ride and I have been riding this in the city for many years now. It's too hot, yeah. The temperature of the outside is 30.5. It's, it feels more. क्या बोलू तेरे को मैं कुछ भी कहने से डरता हूँ चलो 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 लेट्स गो लेट्स गो अरे यार भाई साहब चलो ना यार इतना स्कूटी लेके इतना क्या आराम से चल रहे सो आई हैव नो कंप्लेंस it is about ease of riding and this is not easy bike to ride in the city it hits up a lot the weight height 21 inch wheel and everything comes your way riding this bike with ease in the city so i would look for some other option than himalayan avoid it if you are planning to ride only in the city or predominantly in the city let's move on to the next point This is not fun, but I'll do it. <laughs> this. <sighs> so this is an ADV. Now if it is dropped, uh, look, this kind of surface, if it is dropped, it's not a problem. But if it is dropped, if the surface is hard and there is a high traction environment, probably you can alone lift it. I'll show you how do I do it. But if you are alone and the terrain gets difficult, if it is dropped in the high altitude area, low traction environment, mud slush it gets difficult lifting this bike alone is a pain in the neck the weight of the bike comes your way and himalayan is a heavy bike like always the new generation is three kgs lighter but still 196 kgs and obviously you're going to ride with some luggage so it is tip the weighing scale more than 200 kgs 
Look, there are many ways, there are many ways in which you can lift it, but the most preferred for me is to lift it as if you are doing a deadlift. So let me try if I can do it. One, two, three, four. Okay, that was easy. But again, it is easy because you have a very high traction environment and the bike is not slipping. But when terrain gets trickier, difficult and low traction environment, this kind of bikes with luggage, it's not easy to manage, it's not easy to lift. The weight is going to be your biggest enemy. So, if you really don't want to hustle and use your muscle, avoid Himalayan because it's a heavy bike. Let's move on to the last point, fourth. Okay, so the biggest and last reason is tires. Right now Himalayan 450 or 452 would be offered with the tube spoke wheels. In the middle of nowhere when you have a puncture, trust me, it is a very painful process mend the puncture. I have suffered a lot, especially the rear one get punctured a lot. Look, <laughs> I have a very bad experience with this. So I was coming back from Rajasthan, finishing my trip, entered Hyderabad and the tire was flat. Last time I came, the tire was flat. 8 km before, AWH colony is in front of him. He had to take the bike, he had to take the bike, so he had to take the bike. This brother has helped me. Okay, let's go. Okay, this is a good one. Let them come. तो जल्दी पहुंच गया मैं हैदराबाद के अंदर लेकिन ये लास्ट में होना ही था कोई नहीं अभी एक बार बनता है फिर इसके बाद मैं आगे देखेंगे इसका कोई परमानेंट सॉल्यूशन होगा तो वो करवा गोप्रो लगाने का मौका मिला नहीं है आफ्टर पंचर बनने के बाद मैं मैं ऐसा भागा हूँ वहाँ से hard work so these were the four reasons not to go for the Himalayan but there are 40 reasons to go for the Himalayan we'll talk about all of them in the next vlog I hope this video will be good if you liked it then give it a like and if you don't like it then give it a like और अगर पसंद नहीं आया है, then you can dislike it, but write it in the comment section that what is what was it that you didn't like. और अगर अच्छा लगा है, you liked it, then give it a thumbs up and also write in the comment that what you liked. Tell me more about the bike that you own. Tell me more about the Himalayan. What is your thought? And I will see you guys in the next vlog. Till then, stay safe, stay healthy, and take care of yourself. Bye bye.